This is your Flash Briefing, brought to you by your local York dealers. A Kansas City woman injured in a crash with a man running from police has died. Rebecca White was driving near 47th and Raytown Road back on February 19th when another car slammed into hers. White's three-year-old daughter was also seriously injured. The driver of that other car, Miguel Ayaya, is charged with resisting arrest and driving while intoxicated. According to court records, his blood alcohol level was more than four times the legal limit. A Missouri man is now charged with killing a 14-year-old classmate nearly three decades ago. The suspect was arrested in 91, but the case ended up being dropped until now. Cole County detectives say they believe William Christopher Nemet shot and killed 14-year-old Greg Jones. Jones' body was found near the Mora River by Russellville. It was a story of my life when I was young that I just thought was unresolved forever. You know, I thought I would go to my grave and it would have never been answered. Detectives are not saying what prompted Nemitz's arrest or the circumstances around Jones's death. Police are asking for possible victims of sexual assault to come forward. Mort and Cassandra Wiedeking, an Overland Park couple, have been charged now with raping a woman in July of last year. This was on a on a boat on the Lake of the Ozarks. Now police believe these two may have had other victims. So if you by chance are a victim or maybe even a possible witness and you feel comfortable coming forward, you can call this number here on your screen. I'm Storm Track 5 meteorologist Alina Lee with your midday weather update. In fact, today's going to be very beautiful compared to the last few days. Temperatures at least should warm up to near 50 degrees. And we're also going to be seeing maybe a few sprinkles, but I don't think it'll amount to much. You'll notice on our forecast track, it doesn't show much through 1 o'clock. A very slim chance of a shower or very light sprinkle expected through the afternoon, while the latest update on forecast track shows you absolutely nothing. Just be mindful that there may be a little sprinkle on your commute heading home. Other than that, clearing skies through the rest of the evening, and that should help our temperatures back down into the upper 30s. So for the next few days, enjoy this nice little warm-up we have in store for you. 52 degrees this afternoon, and then we should be near 60 on Saturday, 64 expected on Sunday, a little bit breezy, and the next chance of rain returning as we head through early next week. Gary Amble will be up with an update later on today, and you can always catch us on air or online at KCTV5.com. Have a good one. Turn to KCTV 5 News for the latest updates. This is your personalized flash briefing because KCTV 5 News stands for you. Brought to you by your local York dealers. Heating and cooling products built in the Midwest.